Hey, what's going on, world? This your boy T, right? And Billy Pat. You know you always rocking with your boys right here on the Intern Show. First and foremost, man, I want to thank everybody for being tuning in with us, man, rocking with us right here on the Intern Show. We truly appreciate it. Thank you. But Pat, man, you know one thing that's just getting me furious. What is? Man, the NCAA March Madness break. Oh man, please, I'm the one here about that. So you tell me your team obviously did not make it. Man, my bracket got ruined after the first game. After that Ohio State and Dayton game, man, I was heated. Man, for, for me, anybody know me, man, I'm a huge Tar Heels fan. I love Tar Heels, man, I've been rocking with them. Since I seen Michael Jordan play, you know, he worked in my eyes, he's the greatest basketball player of all time. And after they lost, then Duke lost, and then I was trying to hold it down in the South, man, you know, go ahead and get it with Florida. And then they lost. Don't get me started on Duke. I, I was upset. Like, I was furious. But I had Duke going all the way to the final four. You and like 3,000 other people. I was like, what? Man, I wanted to break my computer, dog. I was so heated. Don't do that. <laughs> was, Don't do that. You were crazy, man. <laughs> Don't do that, dog. But I do want to send a special shout out to the University of Connecticut. That school is on, they are turned up right now. Yeah. Because the girls and the guys won. Man, that's really dog. Really? For real? Man, how the boys and the girls win? The girls won because they are undefeated. They're like 40 and 0. Okay. And then the boys won too. Man, that's really. Uh, they so. cheated. How so? Man, they cheated. I bet them girls can beat you. I bet you they can too. <laughs> I bet that. I would boy, I'd run out of court one time. I might get tired. Boy, I ain't lying. That's not getting beat by the girl, this is getting beat by yourself. <laughs> well, Billy Pat cannot play basketball. I would get out there and try to cross you up. Well, I I won't, you know, I won't accomplish. You know, won't accomplish nothing. Uh-uh. You feel like the water drain should just be crying about being block shots and everything. I ain't gonna cry now. I might fake an injury or something. Billy <laughs> <laughs> Pat will be on the injury reserve. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all might not see me on the show for a couple months. But uh, you know what, man? I want to also say we have been doing a lot of work right here, man. We finally got a brand new intern show Facebook page up. So go follow us on Facebook. That's intern show Facebook. Get our no lights up, like all the way up, turn them completely up. And, and make sure you go to YouTube and watch the first show and give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, leave leave your comments also because your comments are very very special. And we just want to hear what y'all got to say. And also, I want to send a special shout out to a brand new assistant we got from my own boy, my, my fam. Love him like a brother. I'm a brand new mother. Mike Brown, man, he's been doing a lot of work with us, man. And we want to say that we're already, man, we appreciate all, all the hard work you're putting in. And also, my boy, James. Yes, sir, that's right. right. Florida Evans style. Um, man, James has been doing a lot of work with us, too, man. We want to let you know we appreciate it right here. Rocking that time clock was good, huh? Yo, yeah, oh buddy. But right now on the intern show, man, we got a hot show lined up for you guys. We got Paradise Vibe. They are in the building. That's so right. spring, it's been in the air. I know you can't tell it because we didn't have a lot of rain. We didn't see some snow. And some of the places, man, we didn't see some earthquakes going on too. But Paradise Vibe is gonna let you know how you get down for the spring, how you can buy a smooth thing for the summer. Yo, what's going on, world? It's your boy T. Right. And did it pay. Rocking with us right here on the Intern Show. Yeah. We got your boy sitting right here, my man, man, G. Scott. What's up, bro? And my homeboy, Joe Star. What up? And we've been talking about all week, man. You know, spring is definitely in the season right now. And it may not be looking like it throughout all the other seasons been going on because we've been having snow, rain. But spring is through with my homeboy's Paradise Vibes. Let you guys know what you can be rocking right now for spring, heading into the summer. What's going on, fellas? What's up, what's up, what's up? Oh, man, I can't call it, man. Shoot. So tell me what's going on, man. What's, what's up with Paradise Vibes, man? Uh, well, Paradise Vibes is basically a new brand. You know, it's something new to the table. It's something real cool. You know, it's urban. It's sophisticated. It's fly. It's right. different. It's cool. And I, and you know, right now we're in the college town, college community, and I feel like the college students, they're going to take to a purpose. 
Okay. I mean, it's a people's brand, and hey, we just here with it. That's what's up. So when did y'all brand first establish? Man, the brand first established back in 2012. I was kind of lost out there in the world. Didn't know what kind of direction I wanted. You know what I mean? So Understand? I had to sit down and really think about life and purpose. As I feel like, you know, God gave me this purpose and it gave me paradise vibes. So I just had to take it and run with it. True. Okay. That's what's up. That's what's up. Now, when you think about paradise vibes, where did that name come from, man? Because I think about a lot of clothes, you know, people rocking polo and stuff, so it came from rap on. But paradise vibes, that is never, I've never heard that in the streets before. So it's like a mindset brand. Like, paradise vibe, everybody, I want everybody to have that relaxation feeling, you know, every day. That's what it's all about. Just having that. That paradise vibe feeling every single day. Just being energized, rejuvenated. Okay, smooth, man. All right, you know what I'm saying? You might put on new clothes and you never know what may happen after you put on So we know y'all have like shirts and sweaters. So do y'all do anything for females or is it just males? Um, right now, like, it's, it's not really just males or females or anything like that. Right now, like, the stuff that we've been coming out with, like, it's been unisex. That's all I mean, we want really too much males, too much females, anything like that. You would say. Okay. So if my girl want to get one of y'all shirts, she'd be spouting profile. Man. I I guess, uh, like you said, it's something new, it's something different. So uh, everybody people like you. Know, everybody like fresh. Everybody like cool. That's all I want to put out there. Oh, that's all we want y'all to put out there. It's all smooth, fresh, like vibe. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, you know, I think about what I've seen because I've been doing just off for a minute. You know what I'm saying? And, and when he came back and told me like they didn't want clothes, I ain't gonna front first time. I was like, where clothes come from? Cause most people now, you know, in our market, man, they think about doing nothing but we do work like we do, yep. and they also think about doing nothing like music and stuff. And I know for a fact, y'all have any other stuff that y'all working on, like music? Yeah, I got some music. Um, I got a mixtape that's gonna drop. I have it. Officially set up date yet for it, but it's called Million Dollar Weekend. So look out for that soon. Million Dollar Weekend. Brother, you got a sleeve? I got. Let me You see this? You see the sleeve right here? Dreams. That's what it's. That's what it's all about. So go after it. Okay, that's what's up. Just all about you, man. Well, you know me, man. I'm a real creative dude myself, and you know, like with Paradise Vibe, like I'm, I'm in Paradise Vibe. You know. About the clothes and all that, but I mean, you know, I make music, so I mean, I always use music as an escape to you know, anything that I'm going through, anything that's going on, anything that I'm inspired by. Like, I mean, that's my thing with music, and so yeah, you know, wherever I go, that's what music I'm doing. Okay, okay. So, so when y'all first started, like, was it just Joe Star that came up with the idea, or was it both y'all just collaborating? Well, that was actually my idea, but me and Joe Sam had became good friends, so and I know his drive. His drive was like a 745 with no brake pads. He always on the go. He ain't slowing down. He ain't stopping. So I was like, man, he'd be a perfect partner for the job. So I called him up, and he was down with it. Okay. That's what's up. Now, if I'm looking for Paradise Vibe clothes, man, you know, tell me the market, man. Tell me how much, how, how much I'm about to come out. Cause I'm, I'm price like $3.99. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. So, yeah, I mean, how, yeah. much, how much you know pair of five clothes gonna run for me? Um, in the price range, you know, maybe around like 30, 30 and up. You know, 30 to a million dollar shirt. So no okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, this million dollar shirt, can you tell us where can we get it? Oh, you can't get there right now. <laughs> I can't even talk about that. Like, right, what, what's the okay. website where we can find <laughs> Well, the website is, um, ParadiseVibeClothing.com. Okay. And um, in the next, within like the next couple of weeks, like you'll see, like the website is actually up right now, but we don't have anything on there because everything that we have, like we sold out of, so we just switching gears with everything right now. Okay. And so we come with new designs, you know, uh, just a whole new look with the brand. And so yeah, within like the next couple of weeks, you know, Paradise Bob, but keep it on the radar, keep it in the back of your mind, you know, Paradise Bob, we will be coming soon. Okay, well right quick, we're going to pay these bills, y'all, because you know what, we're going to pay the bills, you're going to be seeing this soon. I'm so we're going to take this transition real quick, let you guys holler just on this break, and we're going to get back and holler at my boys right here from Paradise Valley.
that see me get guap right now. See me get guap right now. See me get guap right now. This to all of my hating hoes that see me get guap right now. See me get guap right now. Hell yeah, won't stop right now. This to all of my old hoes that see me get guap right now. See me get guap right now. Hell yeah, won't stop right now. See me get guap right now. Hell no, won't stop right now. Hell no. Yo, what's up? Where we back? You chilling with your boy Billy Pack? You know I'm close on your boy T, right? We in the building. You rock with us right here on the Intern Show. So we back in. If you just not just just now tuning in, we chilling with your boys right here from Paradise Five. That's right. And <laughs> the man turned up right now. <laughs> so right now, man, we've been chilling with them and they've been telling us about the spray calling line they got going on. So in the springtime, we're just not getting here. Summertime is basically on the way. My oh, man's got everything to get you hooked up. But one thing that's been on my mind is what do y'all come up with? Design for the clothes. I mean, what's what's been the major inspiration for the design for the clothes, man? I mean, it's just the love for the fashion. I mean, you got two eyes, you know what you like, so you just run with it, just create. But do your design have some kind of meaning? Oh, well, every design may have a meaning. Okay, let's share with together right now. What is, what's the meaning to it? The meaning behind this. Break it down. Okay. I love gold and I love money. That's the meaning of it. Everybody's fine. Okay. Gold okay. I like to sleep. You say dreams? Dreams. Dreams. That's what's up, man. You gotta go chase, chase your dreams. That's right, man. If you don't go chase them, man, somebody else will come and get them from you. So, why not be a transcendent starting first? Paradise Five Dream comes a lot. All right. Is there anything that you want the, the fans to know? Because right here, they're trying to show up. I'm going to tell you right now, you're about to blow up. So, whatever y'all had going on, just think five times for it right now. Hey, man, that's good to know. <laughs> so, that's good what, to know. what do you want the world, not, not right here, but world to know about Paradise Bob that nobody knows? Like, where can they get your clothes? Everything. Uh, well, we'll start, start off where they can get the clothes. When the website is officially back up and running, and we have products on there, uh, product on there you can go to www com, as well as you know you get um, info from both of our Instagram and my Instagram is uh, JoeStarM5 just playing there like I'm always on there I'm always um, posting new pics and you know I'm directing people to the link www.paradisebobclothing.com so yeah and you can find me at gscott864 on Instagram Facebook Garrett Bridges yeah. And we want the whole world to know, you know, never stop dreaming. Go out there and go get it. Yeah. Being transcendent, being running, what I always say is, you know, so we started right here on the intern show, man. We started grinding. Uh, a dream became reality. Reality is right what you see right now. So definitely, it's, it's, it's a lot, you know. And, and from, from myself, and I think Pat agreed with me as well. Is you know, faith has a strong prospect in it, man. So I know y'all had a small seed, man, it's growing. So we want to say right here at the time show, we co signed it, man. Go get your Paradise Five clothes right now, partner. Yeah. yeah. And right now, forget the website. I just want to know where can I get that t shirt right now? <laughs> <laughs> for the free, for the free 99. Yeah. Free 99. I'm not even hey, free. Hey, we're going to talk after this. Hit. Oh, we're going to talk. Okay, hey, you gotta get the teams up too now. You, you got, we got three other members. Yeah, hey, that's five shirts. Hey, we got you. Like, okay, you, you, you talking to the men behind everything. You know, we at the top of everything. Okay, you know, this hope. You know, I, hey, I, new time, new time. Hey, the the different thing is just because the camera. Hey, yeah, that's <laughs> hey, on y'all next shows when we get y'all y'all shirts, y'all let them know. Hey, you know, uh, you know. Know. Okay, okay. But yeah, um, real quick before we. Okay, um, to answer one of your questions you um, asked earlier, something about Paradise Bob that, you know, that people don't know or something they might want to know about it. Um, just about the brand of all, like, Paradise Bob is, 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 is a real confident brand, you know? It's a real confident brand. It's, um, it's one of the brands that we, we try, we, 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 we plan on putting Paradise Bob in front of everybody because, you know, it's just, just moving around everywhere. Yeah. Um, I hope you land in the state. State to state, city to city. Okay. Well, after this show, it's not going to be state to state, city to city. It's going to be global to global. And if that's what you know, Paradise Vibe is going to be smooth, mellow, and high.
how to stay out like Carmelo. So, uh, <laughs> we're going to get a big best But you're chilling with your boy T, right? And Big Bad. And our, and our boys right here from Paris Vibe, and we'll holler at y'all on the flip side. Yo, well, we're back. You're chilling with your boy Pity Pat. Your boy T, right? Right here on the end time show. Right now, we normally do the future phenoms and the campus legends, but right now, we want to do a remembrance to Fort Hood. That's right. Um, if you haven't heard, um, basically, we had a, a, a soldier actually had you know some psychological issues, and he went through and, and had some tragedy um, hurting a lot of individuals on post. And from one soldier to all my brothers and sisters in arms, I want to say this man has got to stop. Um, if you remember, we had it back going on back in 2009. The same incident happened uh, with a major um, that had done it. And right now, we have a, a NCO has done the same casualties to a lot of people in Fort Hood. So what I want to take the time out and directly saying is all this madness has to stop. We definitely got to keep the peace. We are brothers in arms. You're my comrades. You know, we are all battles in arms. I've got to have your back. You got to have my back. So here at the intern show, we want to say thank you for what you've already do, but we also got to say stop the, stop the vibes, man, right here at the intern show. So this your boy T, right? And Pity Pad. And you know we'll be right back. Yo, what's going on, world? This your boy T, right? And Billy Pat, rocking it right here with us on the Intern Show. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah, it's right. This time of the show, man, we like to recognize some people that's doing big things in the area right now. You know, we like to call them, you know, future phenoms, few campus legends that we got going around around town. You know what I'm saying? So right here, I'm gonna go ahead and knock out these future phenoms. But Pat, can you go ahead and tell people what a future phenom is, real quick? Well, you know, a future phenom is just. Someone who's doing it big in high school, maybe middle school, or even elementary. And just from academics to sports, anything, anybody can be a future phenom. That's what's up, that's what's up. Well, one future phenom I got right now, man, she's very dead in my heart, man. She's family bred, so you know she comes straight with strong genes. My, my cousin Bianca Wisely, she's still holding it big down in Sandsville, Georgia. Straight from Washington County, Washington County High School to be exact. She is actually going to Augusta State. She is a senior, baby, and she is smart, y'all. Find out that she is majoring in pharmacy and biology. So you know what? She about to be writing prescriptions all day long. Mm. <laughs> and I love it because you know what? We got a future doctor in the family. <laughs> also, man, got another one. Dear my man, man, Pat right here. That's it's right. actually his sister, Simone Scott. God, and this young lady is doing it big. She goes to Belton Honey Pal High School in Belton, South Carolina. And she's doing it big all day long as well. Mm, that's what I'm talking about. The Bearcats is representing all day long. And another one, man, this dude is a future phenom, campus legend, doctor legend. Everything is a legend all day long. He is all this and more. His name is, and I hope I don't mess it up for you, brother, because I love you to death right here from the intern show. T. Wright don't mean no harm. But his name is Akun Tud Ahmad. I know I may say it wrong, so AK is what I'm going to call you for the moment. All right, brother? Um, this dude got a 2100 on his SAT out of a 2400. Whoa. Are you serious? <laughs> And a 5.0 GPA, brother, I was struggling to get a 3.6. Hold on, count down. 5.3, you, you can go that high? Dude, I was just this brother went so high, man, you, DMX can't even get this high right now. But Dude, that, that's, yeah. off, that's off the grading scales. It is way off the charts. He has scholarships, A scholarships, to go to school, as he already represented, Old Tech High School. He's actually got opportunities to go to Yale. Mm. Brown, mm. Columbia, Northwestern, 
USC, UCLA, Howard, and that's just to name a few. Mm. So you know the local schools is killing the game to get this young man to attend that school. Salute to you, bro. Man, dog. <laughs> I don't know what you majoring in, but you're going to be blessed no matter what it is. But, Pat, you know, you got some of the major ones going that's already in college, man. We call them campus legends. So what's going on with them kids? Well, right now, I have three that come to mind right now. All right. And got my main man, LJ Peach. That's what's up. Going to George, Georgetown University. And Shaq Davidson going to USC. And Samantha... Bridges going to college, going to the College of Charleston. That's what. So up. salute to these three man. They're doing yeah. big things in college, man. I just want to tell them just continue doing what you're doing. And right here on the intern show, just we encourage you. Yo, this your boy Pity Pat. And you know your boy co signer This your boy T right in the building. And you know we can't leave you without a 30 second turn up. So you know what we about to do, Paradise Five Turn up. Ha, 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 ha. 